What's going on, everybody? Welcome to GMI's World, and a new head-to-head -head free player is Marcellus Wiley. Like, I, I don't know why he's an ultimate ticket or whatever kind of ticket he is or why he's even a player in um, Ultimate Team because overall for his career, I'm not trying to knock anybody. Look, the guy played in the NFL, but he wasn't Ultimate Team status, I don't think. You know what I'm saying? Like, the dude made a living. I hope, you know, he still does a couple shows. I think, what is it, ESPN? Um, and he, he has a decent career. But what I'm saying is when you think about Ultimate Team, you're thinking about specific um, people when you're thinking legends. I just don't know if he was that good. You know, I saw him play. I watched him play. Um, and like I said, kudos to anybody that can make it to the league. A lot of people can't say they even made it to play in the NFL. But I'm just saying... It's a big difference between legend and, um, you know, just an average player. And um, this guy came in as a legend. So I'm just saying, like, bro, no hate, even though it's going to come off as hate. Even if he's my homie, like, I'm very, very happy for him. You know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to explain this so that people understand. It's just like, Lawrence Taylor is a legend, but Marcellus Wilder is also a legend. You know what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't... I, I don't know how to really explain it. I, I can't. Maybe you guys can explain it for me. I'm just saying. But he's the card, so we're playing for that card. His card does have pretty good stats, though. So it was really worth it for me to get it right now. Now, pretty much what you have to do is this. You're going to have to win a Super Bowl on All Madden or a second team All Madden um, in Ultimate Team Head-to-Head. -head. That's it. Very, very simple. Um, I will tell you this, though. After that Marvin Harrison, that motivator card was um, removed from the head-to-head -head, uh, reward. There hasn't been, I haven't been getting DC glitched a lot, so I can't really complain about those things. Right here, we're just gonna burn Nitrine Dick Lane because he can't play D. Um, but yeah, uh, it's it's been a rough route, rough, uh, what, what what the fuck? I'm about to say a rough road? Like, I'm a, yo, I'm, get, I'm getting tongue-tied, bro. Uh, it's been a rough road, man, because Emmett Smith is about to just run it for six. And I don't understand how that just happened, but I'm gonna tell you this right now. This game makes me, yo, just gives me scurvies, dog. Like, I don't, Whatever, man. Like, these things are going to happen. I'm not even... What the F? Oh, just get swerved real quick. Hashtag TSG. It don't really matter, dog. Like, I'm just telling you right now, guys. Um, I don't know how much more of this I can take. But I'm going I'm to I'm see if I can hang in there, bro. Because we, we're not quitters here at GMI's World, man. Like, we keep going with the flow. We figure out ways to get it through, man. And, and this dude, Emma Smith, is figuring out ways to make me rate... Yo, I was about to break this game. Because this dude was consistently coming out. And my guys were just getting blocked and... I don't know exactly why they were taking the angles they were taking. I kind of liked it. It turned me on in my pants. But it probably is something that I don't want to happen ever again. Why wasn't it a fumble? Why was it just incomplete pass? Yo, this dude Tom Brady gets all the calls, bro. Like, what is going on right now? But, again, it's the Super Bowl. I'm just trying to get this card because I've gotten every card except for that Marvin Harrison. Because every time I got to the playoffs... I either got DC glitch wildly or something else happened. And what was weird about it is I, EA Sports is very, very, um, I don't know if they're secretive about certain things that they do, but do you notice that certain things just don't work at certain times? Like those same guys that were glitching and stuff like that, after that Marvin Harrison, uh, they took it out. I don't think they're just going to stop. Why wouldn't you just keep glitching? But I think basically people have been tweeting and, and things like that. And um, I think behind the scenes they're doing stuff because it just stopped. And a lot of, it wasn't just me, a lot of other dudes when that Marvin Harrison motiv motivator card was out, was getting glitched. And then it just stopped. But I, again, I don't know, because it's not like back in the day. Like in Madden 11, what was it? No, what was it? Madden 08? Was it Madden 08? Like when, like, I'm talking about, I'm going back to like Cooper Go Live. You know who Cooper is? Cooper Go Live. He's like a mainstream glitcher, bro. You know like how you go mainstream with like rap and dudes have, you know, side albums where it's like, you know, mixtapes? Koopa go live. He K-O-U-P-P-A. He's like a mainstream glitcher. And in Madden 08, he was so savage. And there was nothing you could really do about it because they didn't have the communication the same way it is right now. A lot of the things that were going on wasn't really like widely known. So you didn't know. I do think that they do certain things within the game. Like even when you just update the rosters. Like, okay, yeah, dot, dot, even though my guy's in front of him. Like a lot of things change. And I don't know, I can't explain it. But this dude right here, bro, he, he yo, I, I don't know really know what this guy was doing, but I kinda like this guy, bro. I kinda like the way that this guy just didn't give a F. He was trying to ruin my Super Bowl experience, but he's getting swerved right here. I don't give a F. Who is that guy though? Why is that guy not getting swerved fully? Why doesn't he have fully swerve activated? Why did I take that lane? I should have just cut and went straight outside. Why did I did you see Deion Sanders just why did I throw that pick? Yo, did you just see Deion Sanders on the play before that when I was running just jump up in the air and just dive by himself when nobody was around him? This, this game is pretty ill, man. I, I don't I don't know how to explain it, but it's very, very exhilarating. It gets your blood pressure going. Like if you're having problems with your blood pressure, you should play this game. Like if it's low. Only if it's low. If it's high, you're probably gonna die. Um 
j just I'm just letting you understand that. Um, you have to be in in very very good health before you pick up Madden and play it. Uh, Madden 17, 16, 15. If you you know what I'm saying, if you just wanted to know when it went wild. Um, but yeah, if you have high blood pressure, I wouldn't recommend raging. But if you if you're like you know like the lower end, like some people have low blood pressure. You know what I'm saying? Believe it or not, um, you could play this game. Your, your blood pressure will go to normal. It may exceed the normal uh, rate, but I don't think that you would probably die from it. But if you you know if you if you're one of those people that suffer from high blood pressure, uh, be careful, man, because I'm gonna tell you right now, this game right here gonna do some things. Like it's not things, it's things. Like T H A N G S. Yo, swerve him, bro. What the fuck? Who is that? And why was he sliding around like he's on ice skates after the play was over? Okay, I just think I went for it on fourth down. I don't know why I did that, though. Because I didn't make any sense. Because this is... Oh, I'm up 14? Oh, yeah, yeah. This guy's garbage. All right, it doesn't really matter. I don't know why I did it. I wasn't paying attention. And he, those are his reads on third and 16. So this guy's pretty much... You know, he doesn't even... Did he get there? But yeah, yeah. I think the ball was short. I think he challenged it. I don't know why you would challenge that, though. Like, EA Sports going to reverse it. EA Sports tells you what they're going to do. And you better like it. And you better shut the F up about it, bro. It did look like he made it across the line, though. But shout out to EA Sports, man. They wanted me to get this card. Um, so I don't know what I'm going to do with this card right now. Obviously, you can't sell them. They're all non-auctionable, which is NAT for the guys that are asking what NAT means. Like when they say NAT, that's just non-auctionable. Um, yeah, nice animation. That's been going on for a while. I wonder when they're going to stop that because it's pretty stupid if you ask me. Um, so he's still running the ball down 14. I think that's what he's doing. Yeah. All right. Okay, bro. Yo, did, did this guy right here, you know what, you know what, this is this guy, you know this guy? Like, this guy is really, really out of his mind. He's really, do you see those eaters, though? Do you see that, do you see that dual edge just coming straight in, just screaming? So, fourth and ten, this is his read. All right, cool. All right, so this guy's about to go ahead and go pet his dog, bro. He just gonna just, he said he had to quit the game to go pet his dog. He can't do it both. He can't do it at the same time, bro. He had to disconnect the game. No, he conceded. This dude conceded. Yeah, he, a gentleman quit. He did a gentleman quit. All right, cool. So, I'm gonna show you what happens after that, because... You, depending on what you've been doing, if you've been following up on a lot of the things that's been going on, you should be completing other um, objectives because uh, they have the new objectives. I still haven't finished my loyalty objectives. I'm trying to bring my, you know, my mindset to go to do it, but I really, really can't play this game for long periods of time. But I'm trying, guys. I'm trying to do it. Um, I'm gonna see what I can do, man. I wanna do it, but to be playing Madden up until July, I'm probably gonna have no eyeballs and no eye sockets left. But you know what it is? If it's for you guys and your entertainment. I'll do it. I'll lose my eyeballs for you. So there's the card right there. He has jumped the snap for D-line users. Um, in my world, D-line users are still shunned. But hey, it is what it is, man. Yo, jump the snap and just run right at the quarterback and sack him instantly. And then don't make it respond to nano detection because that's actually genius. Like, I just can't with the stuff that goes on, man. I just, I really just can't do it. But his stats look pretty decent. Right now, I'm going to show you who we got out there. Um, that we're actually, you know, listen, Daniel Hunter's been doing this thing. You know what I'm saying? But we may have to take him out of the game for a little bit and just start this dude. I'm going to let you guys know what's going on with it. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully, you subscribe and share the video and join me on this journey to 100K. G Myers World. One love.